Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. And hopefully today's gonna be a pretty good day when it comes to the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X restocks going on. We actually do have some confirmed restocks going on today. We do have the confirmed uh, online listing as well as also confirmed walk-ins going on. As well, we also have a few little updates as well for all the big tier retailers and a few other old like YOLO drops that could or could not be going on as well. And I'm sure you guys all know we're also kind of anticipating and waiting for a lot more Black Friday deals. We'll probably have a lot of videos out throughout today tomorrow and throughout the weekend too as well kind of updating you guys like day to day as any big black friday deals actually kind of pop on off but overall we should actually i think for the next like few weeks few months will probably be actually be pretty good for all the restacks so if you guys are ready for that although like i said today at least we do have some confirmed stuff so let's go dive on into it so if any of you guys are brand new make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new playstation 5 giveaway amazon links down below for the ps5 disc digital console controller twitter and twitch room as well link down below sign up for weeble the pause at 100 dollars. you guys go get free stock free money coinbase you guys go buy 100 dollars worth of any cryptocurrency you guys go get free bitcoin of course leave a like on the video if you guys want to or if any of you guys actually go check out these opening stores and everything else you guys can as well if you guys saw the video yesterday we have a little bit of kind of the same kind of same old same old but small updates with it so you guys all know but so let's go dive on into it so first and foremost the confirmed restack going on today check your emails boys check your emails if you guys signed up for the playstation directs be on the lookout for it PlayStation Direct actually sent out a wave of emails last night. And also, if you guys want to check, sometimes you go and see emails that kind of show up a little bit later on, depending on your email service and from Sony themselves. But when it comes to that stuff, we do have a confirmed drop for that going on today at 11 o'clock Pacific, 12 o'clock Mountain, 1 o'clock Central, 2 o'clock EST, I believe is the proper times. If I messed that up, whatever. <laughs> you guys just go basically check your emails. If you guys know the proper times for it. I always want to give you guys a quick reminders for it as well when it comes to the PlayStation Directs because they're kind of doing a more like only invite type style. If you guys got the email, congratulations, but you still have to go make sure you guys get the console. You guys have to make sure you guys get the good stuff. So make sure you guys, as you guys need to, we have been hearing reports like this is not, I haven't had it myself. So this is just based on the community that if you guys have multiple browsers open, multiple tabs open, like pull out your phone, et cetera, and enter it into the queue link that should give you like additional entries that have hopefully a lower queue time. And as well, also, we've been also hearing some rumors once again. I have not had the invite link myself yet, so but we've also been hearing rumors if you go show up a little bit earlier, it might also increase your chances. Before they used to say like show up exactly on the dot. If you showed up earlier, it may go and exclude your chances. But now apparently some people are saying you want to show up a little bit earlier too as well. I'm not have a confer confirmation on that. I'll give you guys more details as we see more PlayStation Directs roll out. So we have seen Sony go and saying confirm that they did want to go do more of them in general. So keep that in mind. As well, we also I'm sure you guys heard this from yesterday. We'll go to other stuff right afterwards. Use the timestamps if you guys need to. But we also did also confirm that there is a few walk-in events going on as of today. So. If you guys had a chance to go and see, we actually have a brand new Costco brand opening. This is for Georgia in the Pooler, Georgia area that should be opening up as of today. So if you guys see this video and you guys are in Georgia, I would probably say go now. Apparently, some of the stores are usually kind of selling out stock pretty quickly, depending on the areas and locations and all of that. So go if you guys want to go and check. Apparently, they have 170 PlayStation 5 bundles and 156 Xbox Series Xs. As well, also, there was another store that was supposed to be open. Uh, we covered this up a little bit earlier on, but I think they also did recently postpone their grand opening. And that was for the Fiera Florida uh, store in general. That was supposed to be launching today. They had some good stack numbers, but apparently they were moving their store launch, I think, to December 9th. So we'll keep a mental note for that. I'll maybe remind you guys on December 8th as well, if you guys are in the Florida area. So keep that in mind. But... When it comes to those, usually if you guys go in the store, you have to, have to be a Costco member and you basically have to go and make sure you guys uh, go and find the actual consoles themselves. When they have all the consoles there, basically they're in like a little weird container, like cardboard container type thing or whatever. And as you guys go and see that, you just have to go and show up, end up there and like you just grab them, you take it to the front desk and you're good to go. Uh, so basically just make sure you guys are on top of that if you guys want to. There was a few other various stores that we have mentioned as well, although there are more on the taper and on lower amount of stock in case you guys are curious on all of that. But we also so did go and see some of them also replace out stock a little bit later on so it might be worth it to check throughout the next one or two days i'll probably give you guys a reminder on tomorrow's day-to-day -to -day video as well so now a little bit more for the yolos that that's all the confirmed stuff looking pretty good go to your stores now if you can check your emails now if you can and go from there now let's go for like the little bit of the yolo slash random stuff so I want to keep on giving you quick reminders. This is kind of like more like nothing's confirmed as of now, so you guys know. When it comes to Best Buy, we still have not seen Best Buy do anything with their total tech, Xbox Series X, Halo Infinite Edition, so we're still waiting for them to do any movement or any restocks with that. As well, same thing with Best Buy. They did go do a restock earlier on, 
but we have not seen them do any normal restocks, not behind total tech, as well as also not walk-ins. So we can still be anticipating maybe an Xbox Series X, console 2 as well, or also normal PlayStation 5s, maybe going publicly, not behind total tech, or if they want to, maybe Xbox Series X or Halo Infinite Edition behind Total Tech. We have seen Best Buy favor Thursdays and Friday drops, but also this kind of goes for all the drops and probably will be seen tomorrow too as well. We are probably waiting for a lot of these retailers to wait for a lot of Black Friday stock, so we might see stock arrivals, but they might just be holding on to the stock for the next like week or so, because of course Black Friday will be going on pretty soon, and also that next weekend, the days afterwards, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. As well, uh, I want to talk about Walmart. Now, once again, they could still just be waiting for stock, but we actually have had a few other dates when it comes to Walmart. Let me make another separate video for all, almost all these retailers. There's been so much news that keeps on kind of floating on in, so I want to keep you guys up to date the best it can. But Walmart actually used to have other date listed on their website, although they actually did go and change and remove it, unless it was just a temporary glitch or a temporary change. They did also go and change up a lot of their restock times. So basically right now that kind of bumps up the likelihood in case they want to do anything with the Xbox Series X Halo Infinite Edition, Xbox Series X, or PlayStation 5 disc or digital, mainly because they did change up the website. We have also seen Walmart favor Thursdays and Fridays a lot more so Thursdays throughout these past few months. So something to at least be aware of. Once again, I would not be that surprised if we had a little bit more quieter next few days waiting for Black Friday. But it's kind of good to know on that, at least kind of noting the changes. Target, if you guys saw, we actually did see a small amount of Target stock arrivals from one of my store. By small, it was actually kind of a bigger stock arrival. But there are still a few other stores that have not gotten any more stock as of yet. So I'm probably not anticipating a drop. I did say yesterday there's a very small chance like today or Friday they might restock. I once again kind of think they're just getting stock arrivals, which is good for Black Friday. Should be some really big restocks for all these places, but I don't think it's going to be a great today. But we've still been seeing reports of Xbox Series X normal editions showing up over at the Target locations and stores. In case you guys are all curious, you guys want to check in your walk-ins and all that. Same with the Switch OLEDs for Target, Walmart, a little bit more for GameStop still, and nothing more else for Best Buy. As well, Amazon. We are still overdue for Amazon. I think I'm probably actually expect another stock arrival. I do have a friend that works over at Amazon itself. So if we have a chance to, I'm going to reach out and see if we can see any more Xbox Series X arrivals or any PlayStation 5 digital arrivals or even PlayStation 5 disc editions. They're all about on the overdue side. So I'll keep you guys in the loop for that if we see anything too as well. Should hopefully be kind of good. And then also, we did not mention anything for GameStop so far. GameStop's been extremely quiet. We did not see them tweet about pro memberships. We did not see them tweet about like any emails. We didn't see any Facebook posts or Instagram posts or whatever. So the likelihood, unless they do like a really big YOLO restock for most of these big retailers too as well, looks very, very unlikely. But we are also hearing more rumors for walk-ins too as well. So once again, they might just be saving and holding on stock going on for other stuff. So very, very nice to go and see all that. And I love seeing that in general. Good to know and see. Now, I think that's pretty much all it for the big boy retailers. Once again, it's going to be like, we have a few YOLO chances, but nothing crazy. Part two on this, Costco. We actually did see Costco do an Xbox Series X restock, so you maybe anticipate a little bit more maybe PlayStation 5 drops. We haven't seen too much of a crazy PlayStation 5 bundle from them in the morning hours. Sam's Club, throughout Thursdays and Fridays, we've actually seen a lot more uh, Sam's Club action. They're also pretty much overdue for the PlayStation 5s as well. I think they also did an Xbox drop throughout this week. So it would not make that much, like, not sense. <laughs> not sense. It, may, it makes kind of sense that they would do a restock throughout today, especially if Walmart does not restock. We'll watch them, though, because once again, Black Friday kind of gives, like, a little bit more of, like, us trying to wait for more additional stuff. As well, don't forget about Newegg. We haven't seen any Newegg leaks, but basically always go and check in case they do on their PS5 bundles or Xbox bundles as well. Gamefly. Gamefly might be more so maybe next week once again for uh, Black Friday, but we did also go and see them go and note that they want to do a PS5 or Xbox drop in the near future. No Xbox Series X Halo Infinite Editions from them. As well, also too, we also have a few of the mid-tier retailers as well. Like I said, also Anton Lime. We have did see them do their Xbox Series X Halo Infinite Editions. They could always work in a YOLO PS5 or PS5 Digital or even Xbox or even Xbox Series S. All kind of floating around over there in case they would like to go and restock. We also do have the military walk-ins. We've seen a few online restocks kind of tickering on and off, as well as quite a few walk-ins for them. A few confirms for the Xbox Series Xs, depending on your naval base, your location, area, etc., etc., and as well. We've also been seeing a few PlayStation 5s also showing up in stock too as well. We've also seen still a few more BJ's walk-ins. We'll kind of maybe go and see if there's any more floating around. We've been seeing various amounts up in New York, up in uh, like the North and South Carolinas, and also in the DC area. Most of the other walk-in restocks, such as like Fred Myers, Kroger's, Myers, etc. We're still getting like a little bit of information on them, although nothing super crazy. We usually see a lot more walk-ins on the weekend, so we'll keep on maybe tracking for all of that. 
as well as we've also seen a few little stores maybe up in the Florida area as well, but we're going to give you guys more updates on that. b Photos and a lot of the other mid-tier places, such as even Kohl's, have had a few website listing and changes, and same with BJ's Online, although we haven't seen anything super crazy confirmed afterwards. And as well as Verizon never did a PS5 Disc Edition drop, or Digital Edition drop, they only did a PS5 Disc Edition drop, so we'll be watching that too as well. So a lot of like these little mid-YOLO type places, we're kind of more so watching the big retailers because they usually have the biggest stock, but... And also do have the confirmed PS Direct and also walk-ins makes done in. So make sure you guys go. If you guys go, send me a picture, send me a tweet, send me a message. Good luck on your drops either way. And we'll probably have a lot more updates for you guys all throughout the rest of the day. I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. You guys are all beautiful. Have a good rest of your nights, good rest of your days. And make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc, digital console controller, Twitter and Twitch room as well. Link down below. Sign up for Weeble. The boss $100. You guys go get free stack for your money. Coinbase, you guys go buy. $100 worth of any cryptocurrency. You guys go and get free Bitcoin. Those are always linked down below, and I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. Smash the like button. I'll see you guys later on today for more videos. Love you guys.